You can time travel black holes? Generic control in the deck gives me here back with another random video. Today we're doing what if you fall into a black hole? Now this was the video that was requested by one of my super insane patrons, uh, Joshy Creature. Down below he's one of the uh, patrons that's like a different color and bold and underline and stuff like that. Every single month they get to request a video and I am required to watch whatever video wins the poll because I throw it into a poll on YouTube and let you all decide what that video is. And But 99% of my video suggestions come from the comment section because I do read every single comment that is just a mandatory, I have to watch that video. They get to suggest one video, and if other viewers want to see it, then they'll vote for it. And if it wins, I'm required to react to it. I know every time I do one of those polls, people are like, none of the above. Do this video instead. Do this series instead. I don't get to say these videos. I don't get a choice in the matter. That's the whole point of why they are a patron in a support channel, because I wouldn't be able to do this if it was for them and allow me to do videos that aren't monetized. I don't know if this video is going to be monetized. I don't know if I'm allowed to do reactions to this video. Uh, I don't, I've never watched any from this channel before. I'm not going to try to say the name because I feel like if I did, I would end up in prison, but I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope I made it a tiny little better. Shout out to patrons. Like I said, I could not do this if it wasn't for them. I do all this myself, all the recording, all the editing, every single thumbnail, and I read every single comment as well. And I also respond to a lot of comments. So you know, I'm actually reading every single comment even on old videos i do that i also stream four times a week i do this all myself and some videos i don't even make a penny on but i do it to make your day a tiny little better because i'm here to make you smile not make you pay let's go ahead and jump to what if you fall into a black hole now space has always inter black interested me most powerful that is a voice extreme things in the universe what? and they're wildly weird and complicated yes they are what would happen if you fell inside one and what are they really i don't know I don't think we've tried that. I've never seen anything from this channel before, but I know space is way bigger than we think it is. First, that video is mind blowing. We need to talk about space and time. Space and time are the grand stage where the play of the universe unfolds. Yes. But okay. Space isn't a fixed stage, and time doesn't take oh, the same God. for everyone everywhere. Time isn't real. You can't short, see it. They're relative. Matter bends space. I like to use birds because birds aren't space real. Tells matter how to move. Put some stars and planets on the stage, and it sacks underneath them. That misshapen stage, with all its little warps and dips, gives us gravity. Oh, Black okay. holes do not just Portal. bend the I, stage, the they're cake. like trap doors. I just played through the portals so games. Much mass that the I'm streaming Portal 2 co on Saturdays. No go zone where the rules change. Most black holes form when very massive stars die. Very massive. We explained this process in detail in our neutron star video. Yeah. Well, I haven't seen that video, but is that in yeah. the final moments of really That's massive our sun. stars, their insides implode at nearly a quarter of the speed of light. This packs wow. so much That's mass really so fast actually. together, creating something so dense that it sort of breaks the stage of the universe. Oh. A black hole with 10 times the mass of the sun would be but barely small. 60 kilometers across. If you look really directly small. at a black hole, it looks like nothing. nothing. The space under their control is blocked by an invisible one-way border called the event horizon. Oh. The event horizon forms also never a seen interstellar. region of space that once entered is shielded from the rest of the universe forever. Because Jesus. the black hole trapdoor deforms space so much, not even light can escape it. And with nothing escaping to transfer information from the inside, it's impossible to tell what it really looks like. We can still observe so, black holes because of their mm. effect on matter. Things can Center orbit of the Milky Way galaxy. just as they can orbit the sun or a planet. Many black holes have disks of matter orbiting outside the event horizon. This matter can become incredibly hot as close orbits can speed this Jesus. matter up to half the speed of light, and tiny amounts of friction and collisions between particles heat them to a billion degrees, making what? the space around these black holes ironically incredibly bright. What would happen if you were to try to get close or even inside a black hole? I don't. First of all, I don't know. You'd see the strangest funhouse mirror in the universe. Oh, really? Matter isn't the only thing orbiting a black hole. Gravity is so strong near them that light can orbit too. If you hover light just outside can the orbit, event horizon, that's kinda crazy. the photon sphere, in any direction, you just see yourself. Straight ahead would be the back of your own head, as light from your back travels around the black hole to your eyes. Holy crap. Gravity also alters the passage of time itself. Uh -huh. The stronger the gravity, the slower time passes. While you watch the universe Among above us. you speed up, those far away will watch you in slow motion. Huh. If you chose to fly away from the black hole, 
you might find that eons have passed for the rest of the universe a freakish one-way time travel trip to the future where your loved ones are long dead. But getting you can close time to travel black, black holes? Incredibly dangerous. A painful death by spaghettification awaits you. Spaghettification? What? Because your feet are closer to the black hole than your head, they feel a stronger pull of gravity, enough to pull you apart. Oh, nice. As you descend, it gets worse. The pulling gets stronger, your body squeezed thinner and straighter, oh, until you God, get you reduced to a thin stream of spaghetti. plasma, gobbled up in one final slurp, never to be seen again. Spaghettification is only atoms. risk with smaller black holes, since they have much smaller radii. Uh, if you go to the center of a galaxy and find a supermassive black hole, you might be able to experience big was the star crossing that made that? the event horizon. As you approach the event horizon, a distant observer would think they never saw you enter it, seeing you stop and fade. The last oh, light you emit, trickling a long time up ago. and out, away from the event horizon. Meanwhile, from your perspective, the void of the black hole rises up to meet you, as light from fewer directions can reach you. The blackness what? envelops you until your only view of the universe you left is a tiny spot of light. Here, inside uh, okay, the that's horizon, a Doctor Who thing. Space and time are so horribly Spot broken yeah. that real time travel is possible, so it's probably a good thing that nothing gets out. Yeah? If anything could escape, it could that create all sorts of time travel paradoxes yeah, we don't want and that. issues that break the universe. As yeah, as the moves the horizon is, it keeps us safe from that drama. Whether you have survived this long doesn't really matter. As now there's only the Isn't there like a thing where like it can, like your goes future. to a different fold or Inside something like the that? Horizon, space -time itself is so bent and like you can travel across the galaxy with a black hole or something? Every forward you go leads only towards the center of the black hole. Trying to go in any direction only brings you to the center faster. To survive oh. the longest, you must do nothing. What? In the center of the black hole, we find the singularity. A that was a red versus blue season. Matter that has ever crossed Trailer the event horizon, Thursday. all crushed to a point infinitely small. There is no memory of the things that made it as stuff disappears down the black hole trapdoor forever. Wow, that's... The singularity makes all things equal. This actually breaks the universe in really cool ways. We've made a video about this problem if you want to learn more. Did you? But in a nutshell, everything that comes too close becomes black hole matter concentrated at the singularity. This lack wow. of a memory of its past means that a black hole has only three properties. Its mass, spin, and electric charge. Electric. Everything else is lost. They're a lot like fundamental particles in that respect. Okay. This actually means Quarks. that every single black hole in the universe is the same. Sure, their mass is different, and some spin faster than others. Yeah. But if we were to put all the singularities into a what magical physics faster? museum, they'd be identical, like electrons. Oh. But just like fundamental particles, the properties of singularities are the best ways we can describe them on paper, rather than an accurate representation of reality. Our current theories about the universe, namely general Space. relativity, are just not able to describe or explain them. The curvature of space becomes infinite, density becomes infinite, infinite and our rules just don't make sense. The singularity has no surface or size, something huh? like a divide by zero error in the universe. No, we don't know. We so don't want that. That's not good. Not even exist, Nobody asked for that. Or be completely different things. But it's this is all we know right now from the best prediction we have from our best current theory of space time. Also, basically everything you've ever heard about black holes, even in this video, is about theoretical black holes that aren't spinning because their maths is so much easier. Ah. Oh. But since black holes were born from dying stars that were spinning extremely quickly in their final moments, stars spin? As, as we know, all black huh. holes in the universe should be spinning right now. At incredible speeds, too. I mean, it's not like stopping them. percent of the speed of light. This means that in reality, Holy black crap. holes are even more screwed up than they usually get credit for. The singularities of rotating black holes are even wilder. Whoa. The rotation causes them to swell outwards into a sort of ringularity. What? This rotation is so a powerful donut. that space itself is dragged along. This creates another region around spinning black holes called the ergosphere, where uh, it's impossible yes, I to guess stay still name for that. no matter how hard you try. Like a rushing whirlpool of space-time, the tide is irresistible, and the black hole makes you orbit it whether you want to or not. That sounds like a fun roller coaster. Okay. 
So what will happen to black holes as the universe ages and dies around them? Again, we don't know, but we have some ideas based on our current oh, understanding. Ah, okay. Now physics. we're getting into Hawking radiation. In quantum field theory, the vacuum of space is boiling with quantum fluctuations. I... These fluctuations but... are creating matter and antimatter pairs of particles oh, from no. nothing, which only exist for a very short time before Isn't that the most expensive thing on the planet? I believe is antimatter. When this happens Can we make near it? the event horizon of a black hole, one of these particles can fall in, stopping them from annihilating. The escaping particle is Hawking radiation. Ultimately, okay. the mass of this particle must come from the black hole, so over eons, black holes will shrink and radiate away. Hawking radiation is not the stuff that fell into the black hole, it's new stuff, stealing mm -hmm. mass from it. Okay. As the black hole shrinks, the Hawking radiation gets evading. stronger, faster and faster, until what's left eventually evaporates in a flash of high-energy radiation like a nuclear bomb. And then, nothing. But that won't happen for a long, long time. Yeah, space. A black hole with the mass of our sun has a lifetime of 10 to the power of 67 years. That's a big number. Which means that it would take 10,000 billion, 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 billion years to lose 0.0000001% of its mass. But most of lose that, that long. are way more massive than our sun. The most massive supermassive black holes in the centers of galaxies have lifetimes of 10 to the power of 100 Jesus years. Jesus Christ, that's... How long is that? Oh no, Imagine oh god, it's the 51 grain of factorial. sand for every single particle in the universe. Every 10 billion years, one single grain factorial of sand thing all again. falls to the bottom. Oh no, here we go if with we this. If we waited for all the sand to fall down, not even 1% of the lifetimes of these black holes would have passed. There That's is no good concept to help our brains grasp these timescales. Nope. Will we ever truly understand black holes? Not in our lifetime. Really Absolutely know what's not. Going on inside them? And I'm completely okay no not knows. knowing. We can only see their outside. And the probably theories terrifying. we have probably get their insides wrong. Yeah, probably. But it's okay to not know everything. It just means there's still work to be done. It means there are still mysteries to solve and big ideas to think about. Which is why humans do science. I mean, science. In the end, we can at least be sure that Space. we still have plenty of time left to think about the two reference before the last one melts away. I don't think there's going to be any shortage of black holes. If you want to continue ever, thinking about black in an infinite holes, universe, you can do so by getting one of the many black hole-related things the Kurzgesagt team has made with love. I'm sorry. Like what is the name of the black channel? Black hole infographic poster that teaches you all the black hole That's basics. That's kind of sick. Or our choose your own black hole adventure poster. That's not really. That that's more a of a spectacular ride thing to have. Might leave you in need not of so a much couple, of decoration. In which case, we've made a black hole and white hole plushie. White hole. And if that's still not enough, I think I have we've one also of those. just released super comfy space socks, very shiny space pins, Ooh, a new tote pretty. bag and pouch set, and we have many other great space-related products that are all designed Ooh, with love and care by the Starry Night Poster. Looks Kursk sick. Art. Getting something from our shop is the best way of supporting Kurzgesagt yeah. while getting Kurs something Gitar beautiful Uber. in return. Because of you, we can keep making elaborate videos Somebody like explain the name just me. watched and release them for free for everyone. Thank you so much for your support. Great video. Never seen anything from this channel before. Absolutely loved it. Joshy Creature, thank you so much for requesting it as a super insane patron. Oh man, this is a good video. I'm actually going to edit this video tonight and get it out to the patrons tomorrow, which will be Monday. And then, uh, God, that was actually really cool. I like how they, I don't know, I wouldn't say it's really childish looking, but it's easy to follow and understand. Like, if school was like that, I would have learned so much more. Um, but the way they, like, animate and do things is really, I would say it's for kids, but it's cutesy i guess would be a way i don't know it's informative it's really easy to follow that was actually really really cool i'm glad i watched this video i'm glad you all voted for it check the community tab because usually pretty much every single week there's going to be a new poll there might be one uh up today if i'm gonna do that because i gotta record saturday's videos on wednesday because i'm going out of town this week and so i won't be able to record on saturday because i when I go out of town, I still make enough videos go live, and it's a one-man show. So shout out to the patrons. Could not do this if it was not for them. I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day. Hopefully, I made time a little better. Uh, I would love to hear if you have any fun facts about black holes or space or anything like that, because I'm very interested in this kind of stuff. But most importantly, have a wonderful rest of the day. But until next video, take care and keep the music. We were playing.